and Katarina, and we are representing Intra Resilience Investment Fund. Uh, so Remy works for Blue Orchard, and I work for Celsius Pro, and we work together under the, the label of Intra Resilience Fund. Uh, our fund offers funding and sharing know-how with uh, insurance companies or companies active in insurance market. And since we are focused on micro insurance especially and people who are vulnerable to climate, uh, climate changes that are dramatic and affecting their lives, in most cases our projects are focused on uh, um, index-based insurance because this type of insurance really reaches out to the poor and vulnerable. And that's how we see the link also to this conference and that's why we were invited to, to speak and to, to participate in this conference. Yeah, the challenge is, uh, first of all, the lack of awareness uh, about our, our public and, and the clients. Uh, so both farmers and clients of the financial institutions we are supporting. Uh, so I think this is a key challenge, first. And, and the second uh, is obviously the... It's a very nascent market and you don't have a lot of uh, products right now. So um, we have many challenges because this is a very new market for both of organizations. together trying to achieve to have more uh, policy holders that are covered with climate insurance so really close this insurance or this protection gap that exists now in the world and especially in Af here in Africa we are active on the projects where we reach out to the farmers and we try to, to stabilize their financial situation and to make them more resilient for the future so if you have index based insurance or whatever other type of insurance uh, you are sure that you will have financial stability if there is a disaster that strikes your land, you're sure that you will have enough money to, to buy again the grains and uh, the fertilizers to go on with your life. Exactly, so our objective is to build a resilient uh, future for, for people and we are here, we have funds, so we have the money, we have uh, almost 300 million of US dollars of funds to be landed and we have also the know-how within the technical assistance of the fund and we team up with people on the field, with insurance companies, distributors, farmers, etc. to really close this protection gap. Well, we don't have direct relationship with them, but we do work them together on, on projects. We are in the same arena, and I think the micro-insurance arena is really an example where, where corporations and people and companies have to work together. So there is no competitiveness. We are trying to achieve the same goals. We are trying all to close down uh, the protection gap. So we have the same objectives as GIF, and that's why we, we work together, and that's why we are here, and we were invited to, to come here and speak more about this topic. Yeah, yeah. I, mean, I think it's a big enough uh, arena for, for many players to come in and, and to partner, so we are not competitors per se. I think for, for us it's more to connect the dots and to see uh, I mean, all the players in the industry um, uh, across the value chain actually and to see if we can achieve actually uh, the goals we, we have set um, in all our organizations. Okay.